Ladies and gentlemen, Soft Inway Incorporated presents case study demo of preliminary design of axial compressor for middle range gas turbine. Design specification. Operational conditions are inlet total pressure 100 kPa, inlet total temperature 15 Celsius, total total pressure ratio 18, target mass flow rate 200 kg per seconds. Rotational speed 6000 rpm. Target total total efficiency 87%. Type of fluid air. Design constraints are. Minimal hub diameter 900 mm fixed diameter. Inlet guide vanes used. First module for stages or less. Hub diameter of first module 900 mm. Second module 10 stages or less. Tip diameter second module, less than 1,250 mm. First module design. Setting of design parameters for first module. The correct setting of design parameters is critical for successful design. Faux axial compressor axe stream supposes 13 design parameters. All of them may be specified in ranges but for purpose of current design some of them will be set as fixed values. Outlet total pressure for first module chosen as 300 kPa. It is an expert estimation. Outlet flow angle for IGV is set in a range of 65 up to 89 degrees from tangential. Setting parameters in range allows axe stream to choose an optimal value. Hub diameter for first module is fixed at 900 mm according to specification. First blade length is set in a range of 200 up to 350 mm. Work coefficient is specified in a range of 0.2, 0.5 which correspond to middle loaded stages. To decrease of loading on last stages, the specific work gradient set in a range of 0.9, 0.99. After all design parameters are settled, the search of solution can be started. The number of solution to be searched is set to 1000. The solution search is finished, and the design space shows all found good solutions. The first conclusions may be done now. Design space shows that maximum of efficiency was obtained for four stages design. So following procedure may be limited to solutions with four stages. The solution with two and three stages will be eliminated using Design Space Explorer. Solution filtering. After setting the minimum of stages to four, the solution with two or three stages are filtered out and will not take a part in further procedure. Filtered out solutions are colored in gray in Design Space. Solutions Validation To make final choice of solution for further proceeding, it is necessary to run a validation of prospective solutions. Axe Stream allows to perform direct task for all active solutions in design space. All active solutions are calculated with equal boundary conditions. It allows correctly compare different solutions, even if they were designed with boundary conditions specified in ranges. Axe Stream builds temporary project for each solution to be validated and runs direct main line task. Brief results are displayed in log pane. Design Space Explorer shows not only design results but integral validation results as well. This fields are located in the bottom of Explorer table. Design Accuracy Estimation To compare validation results with specification, the efficiency calculated by direct solver is assigned to abscissa axes and mass flow rate to ordinate axes. The reasonable question raised, how accurate inverse solver of preliminary design is? Design space shows that tolerance for most important parameter, that is mass flow rate, is about 2%. And for efficiency, the discrepancies is lower than 1%. The final solution to be selected have to be a reasonable compromise between two criteria to be close to specified mass flow rate and have the maximum of efficiency. According to this, the solution number three is selected. 
and applied. Using maps for solutions validation. For more accurate estimation of found solution, AxStream provides one more validation tool, PDMAP. This is very important for compressors design. Predefined mat is created for design rotation speed and in a range of outlet pressure. PD map, calculated for solution number 3, confirms that the solution has a required pressure raise ratio for specified mass flow rate, and is a good choice for first module. At this point the preliminary design of first module is over, and selected solution is stored in main project database. An outlook of first module flow path. Second module design. To make a smooth transition between modules, the first module outlet component dimensions has been used as geometrical constraints of second module. So, tip diameter of second module will be about 1,237 mm, and first blade length will be about 168 mm. Design setup for second module. Special option allows to inherit inlet pressure and temperature from upstream module. Tip diameter and first blade length are specified according to last component of upstream module. Other design parameters are set according to specification. And second module preliminary design started. Estimation the results of second module design. Design space, obtained in result shows a number of distinctly separated groups of solutions. This groups corresponds to solutions with different number of stages. The six stages solutions are filtered out, and validation started for remain solutions. Solutions batch validation. Set up boundary conditions for direct solver run. To estimate the results of validation direct solver results have be associated with design space axes. Now XY pane displays mass flow rate versus total to total efficiency, calculated with direct solver. Convenience XY plane will be set parallel to monitor screen surface. Estimation the results of batch validation. The results brief overview shows a good accuracy of preliminary design. For more detailed analysis space view have be scaled. Scaled space shows that mass flow rate discrepancies for solutions with maximal efficiency are within 1% range. Solution number 128 is a good compromise between maximization of efficiency and mass flow rate close to specified value. Selected solution is applied. AxStream performs solution restore, that is, generates a design according to solution parameters and build project structures. Solution validation with map. For final estimation of found solution, the validation with have be performed. PD map is called to calculate predefined map for currently applied solution 128. Predefined map is created for design rotation speed of 6000 rpm and in a range of outlet total pressure. PD map, calculated for solution number 128, confirms that the solution has a required pressure raise ratio for specified mass flow rate and may be used for second module design. The preliminary design of second module is over, and module may be added to main project database. When both modules are combined in common flow path, the performance maps of whole machine can be calculated. Joint flow path performance estimation. Map setup. Maps will be calculated mean line direct task for 13 speed lines, by 10 pressure points for each speed line. Performance maps are set up to calculated for a range of rotational speed from 100% down to 20%. Performance maps for two module, 
12 stages, compressor in a range from 20% to 100% of rotational speed. The demo is over. Thanks for your time.